guys, well, if you're gonna have a bunch of guests over for Thanksgiving and you don't know what to feed them before dinner starts, well, not to worry because I'm gonna show you something so easy to make microwavable veggie chips. And they'll take less than 10 minutes to make and you could probably use all the vegetables you have lying around the house that you're gonna use for your Thanksgiving feast. And the great thing about this is you're only gonna need a few things that you already have lying around your kitchen. So we're talking about salt and pepper, seasoning salt, cooking spray, parchment paper, and the best veggies to use for these are the starchy veggies like potatoes and uh, carrots, also squash, because those come out the most crispy. So we're gonna wanna take a large butcher knife and then we're gonna wanna take our veggies and chop them up into slices that are paper thin or as thin as you could possibly make them. Now these are as thin as I could possibly get them. They're not paper thin, but they are thin enough. So you can see I've come up with a lovely cornucopia of chopped veggies, chopped starchy goodness, and they're looking pretty good so far. So the next step, what we're gonna wanna do next is take the parchment paper, take two sheets of it, and coat the whole thing with your cooking spray or your pan. And then we're gonna wanna take our chopped veggies and put them on the parchment paper that's sitting on top of a microwavable plate, and we'll just spread them out evenly. And then we're gonna wanna take our seasoned salt and sprinkle it on our chips. I already messed this up. I used the wrong side, this side without the holes, and I just dumped a bunch on my potatoes. You can see it came out really, really salty. You don't really wanna do that, so make sure you use the side, obviously, with the holes in it. My bad. Go ahead and finish seasoning our chips. Now we're taking our second sheet of parchment paper. We're gonna wanna coat it evenly, make sure it's all on there, and then stick it on the top of the chips. Take our plate and stick it in the microwave. Start off with three minutes and we'll monitor them, make sure they don't burn. All right, three minutes has passed. They still look a little bit soggy, so we'll, we'll put them in that microwave for another three minutes, continue to monitor them, see what happens. And so here they are right there, our finished chips after they've cooled off for just a little bit. And so pretty easy, that's all there is to it. And the great thing about these, these are less than 50 calories per serving. So a normal serving of chips would be about 200 calories or more. These are about 40 calories per serving and uh, easy to make too. And they, they taste pretty good. Lindsay's Life Hacks, creating something in less than 10 minutes for less than $10.